President Trump is still trying to get his arms around and compartmentalize, you know, what's what and what his campaign did or did not do. He just this morning uh, gave an interview to Fox in which he touched on this. So let me play this for you. I don't have any tape and I didn't tape. But when he found out that uh, I, you know, that there may be tapes out there, whether it's governmental tapes or anything else, and who knows, uh, I think his story may have changed. I mean, you'll have to take a look at that, because then he has to tell what actually took place at the events. And my story didn't change. My story was always a straight story. My story was always the truth. But you'll have to determine for yourself whether or not his story changed. So, Maggie, obviously, he's talking there about James Comey. Yeah, there's lots of ways we could clear <laughs> and, this up, actually. I mean, right, but I, I think right. it's also interesting that the president there says, you know, whether there are governmental tapes. Right. I mean, what what is that? He, they were in they were in meeting at the White House. What does that mean? Right. Well, so I, I would I'd put those into two buckets. One bucket is that uh, this president has conducted uh, a pretty extraordinary uh, public campaign against uh, the nation's intelligence agencies. I don't think we've really ever seen anything uh, like this. So that's one bucket. The other is the legal bucket for himself, where suggesting that he was talking, you know, not a, who knows, I wasn't taping, you know, I was saying anybody could have been taping, those government leakers were taping, um, who knows, but you know, it wasn't me, is a way to move it away, uh, as, I, as I said earlier, uh, from uh, any suggestion that he was trying to uh, put pressure on Comey.